What's good, T gang? It's your girl TR, aka T Force, aka Floss, whatever you guys want to call me. And I'm back again with another video. I know, I know, I have not posted for like two weeks now, I think. I didn't post y'all because, like, I was focused on school. I had like so many papers and assignments, do all that crazy. But school's not over, so now I'm back in tune. You feel me? Back to my regular schedule with uploading. So, uh, as you guys can see by today's title and thumbnail, you already know what today's video is about, you feel me? I got some new equipment for my home studio. So I'ma just like explain to y'all why I got new equipment and why I got rid of my old equipment or whatever the case is. But before we get into this video, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more videos from the young goat myself, T. And without further ado, let's get right into this video. Let's go. Hi, y'all. Uh, so, um, the two, uh, well, three pieces of equipment I'm getting rid of. First is these headphones. I'm going to tell y'all more on why I'm getting rid of these headphones. And this condenser mic. You feel me? I'm sending it back to Amazon. And also, my microphone uh, stand. But I'm going to use that until I get my other one, which comes in, like, Friday, tomorrow. Yeah. So, the reason why I'm getting rid of these headphones, don't get me wrong, for well it came with the bundle. Um, but they were they were okay. They weren't like used to the headphones. I'm always like, you know, using and it's like you can tell that it's like very cheap, you feel me? Um, but they did work, you feel me? I recorded a lot of songs with these. They did work, but for my personal opinion, I wouldn't I just wouldn't use these anymore um but if you are starting up a studio and you just want some cheap headphones I'm not saying they, they wouldn't work they would work but I'm I just wouldn't use these you know what I mean and you understand what I'm saying once you just use them after a while um I'm getting rid of my my mic because uh it gave me a great sound but I, it's something, it's just something about it. I just wasn't feeling like I don't really know how to explain. It. I think it was just like the frequency on it. I just wasn't really digging it, so I'm getting rid of this as well. Um, but as y'all can see, I got my big old Amazon box here. You feel me? Gotta cover the Addy, but I got my big old Amazon box right here on the floor, and uh, we just gonna get to unboxing. And I'm going to show y'all what I got. Uh, ah, God damn it, I just scratched myself with a scissor. Damn. Alright, y'all. So, one of the first things I got. Oh, these bad boys looking good. One of the first things I got was... Uh, These studio headphones right here, these are one of the best headphones in the game. These are the Audio Technica ATH M20X. These headphones is crazy. I don't know if you guys can see the difference in the, the boxing. You feel me? Yeah, this is different. I don't know. The description in the back Audio Technica was very more detailed. And the taxon, very, very, very more detail. And uh, these Johns is crazy. Yeah, these these Johns gonna work. Oh, what else I got? I got a pop filter. I oh, I still have uh oh I packaged it up. Oh, uh, I still got the other pop filter that I had, but uh. They said Amazon sent me a new one. It was something went wrong with that. So Amazon sent me a new one. But this pop filter, not gonna lie, it's way better than the pop filter I had. But I mean, they both work. You feel me? Like, you can have either or. They're both gonna work. Um, what else I got? Oh, this page right here. I got an isolation booth. I 
got this isolation booth. This is this is crazy. I'm gonna explain to y'all what everything is once I get rid of this box. And last but not least, this bad boy right here. I got the Audio Technica AT2020 condenser microphone. This thing, yeah, this is this is the one. And I'm gonna tell y'all the prices. I don't need this box anymore, so that's how you get rid of it. So to compare this mic to this uh, MXL 770, in price difference, this is $99. This is $70.69. So if you round it up, $170, $30 difference. Um, this is the best microphone to have when you have a home recording studio. Yes, this right here. Um, the frequency in this, I don't even know if it has it on the box out here. Well, no, nah, they don't have the frequency out here on the box. But this includes a mount and a, a little carry bag. This also includes a, a, a shock mount and a little traveling case. But this this <laughs> um isolation booth what this is basically as y'all can see it has the acoustic pads around it and it just blocks out any sound within or around the microphone and it's good because like when i have the ac running the ac is on 24 7 so when i have the ac running and stuff also my gate on this is still good you feel me this is great or even if i have the window open Whatever the case is, this is the one. And then the pop filter. Well, this, I forgot to tell you. The vocal, the isolation booth was like really, it was $62. Um, This right here was $14 if I'm not lying. The difference in between this and the other one I have, this is $14. The other one was like $8. You feel me? And the other one also came with a shock mount as well. But, uh... Yeah, uh, and then we got obviously the headphones. This is uh, this was fifty dollars, and these Taxons was they actually they run for twenty, but it came with my 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 interface bundle, so fifty and twenty. I don't know if you guys can see, but this one, let me show you how the back. It looks way more durable than these. It looks way more durable. So uh, I don't need this headphones anymore so we just gonna set everything up i'm not gonna lie i honestly don't know what i'm doing <clears throat> on how to set everything up but we just gonna get right into it so the first thing we're gonna set up is the isolation booth because it does a it's around the microphone stand uh came with some papers the manual yeah i'm gonna need this because i don't know what i'm doing but we're gonna see what this look like inside the bag and this came with a little traveling case too because it, it is portable so i could bring this wherever okay so you have this is the isolation booth right here so if you open it i know they got some stuff inside there so these are how i'm supposed to, this is like what i use to set it up on the mic stand so this is the isolation booth so you could curve it like this you feel me i'm gonna get back to y'all when i finish setting this up because i know it's gonna take a minute so i'm gonna see y'all when i finish setting this up all right y'all so i'm back and i just finished setting it up this is how it looks for me this is how it looks i know it looks a bit crooked because so i'm getting rid of this microphone stand because it's just it's just not stable it's not sturdy at all but that's just how it looks you feel me yeah that's how it looks so next what we're gonna set up uh we're gonna do the microphone i'm gonna do the mic got some papers and we got this beautiful beautiful mic it's all packaged nicely and stuff like that audio technica right here and it says back right there, you feel me? Yeah, this bad boy is clean. And then we have like the little uh, carry case. And then inside here we got the, 
we got the mount so what i'm gonna do first all right yeah so this is how it looks with the microphone set up and everything yeah, it's connected to this little adapter piece and as y'all can see it came with a shock i need to block out the light it came with like its own shock mount right here and then it's like a little screw on and then this is where you put the in uh the xly cable right in here so now what we got next uh we got the pop filter I don't really know how to set this thing up, but we just gonna find see how this goes. So I know I'm supposed to put it like. Ah, right, yeah, so I figured it out. It took me a quick minute, but I figured it out. This is how it looks right here. So you can see the pop filter, the mic, with the isolation booth and it's on this stand and this mic stand i'm not gonna lie this mic stand is a hundred percent garbage uh um, my review on that mic stand is just like it's terrible you feel me it's it's horrible so what next we gotta do we just really gotta connect the xlr cable and uh it's um <clears throat> it um since it's a condenser microphone it does need the 48 volts just to have like the power through just to get the signal and to um <clears throat> make sure that your gain on your mic is really good this is how it looks though y'all it looks great my computer's right there i don't know if y'all see i got a new setup so i put my tv and my xbox here and stuff like that and uh i got my main tv right there as well and then all we need to do left is these bad boys these headphones i'm about to try them on too see the like feel the difference in between them there you got your papers and stuff like that and let me just take off the plastic Papers. Let me take off this wrapper right here. And this little whatever y'all call it. And box. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I do keep my boxes, so these right here is gonna go straight into my closet. All nice and neat. So here are my headphones, my Audio Technica. Wow, these feel different too. I'm not going to lie, they feel really different. Oh yeah, these are definitely. I don't hear not one sound around me. With the Taxons, you can hear everything. You can hear everything. So now we just gonna plug up my interface. <clears throat> And everything is set. Everything is good to go. Got to make sure I have a signal and stuff like that. I don't know if y'all want to hear like a little snippet, but I'll give y'all some real quick. i give y'all some a little quick. You feel me? But nah, yeah, I'm not going to lie. These headphones, they're really good. Like, I can't hear anything but myself. You feel me? Um... This setup, it, it, just, it just looks amazing. It does look good. Oh, uh, let's see how it sounds. Uh, I turned it down. Let's see. It's a little snake. Cause I ain't in the streets, but I'm up in all your shades. I'm making all your tweets. That's it. That's all y'all can hear. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I do have a new upgraded setup. I went on my way. But would you do the same for me? You know I'm getting paid. So you still ain't wait for me. Girl, get on my face. Cause I know you won't change for me. And they want my place. But I won't let them take it from me. The hate is real. And the new really. Right, yeah, but I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. I know. 
I ain't posting two weeks, but I'm back on schedule. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more videos from the Young Got Myself T. And if you want to be updated with me, make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Link is in the description. Add me on Snapchat. My link is also in the description. If y'all want to hit snippets of my music, I post on my Snapchat every day. Almost every day, snippets of a new song that I make. And, uh, yeah, so get in tune with me while I'm in tune with y'all. And I thank y'all, T-Gang, for supporting me. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace, y'all. Hey. Look it up. niggas up, so tell me how you want it. How you want it? niggas up, let this bar finish rolling. Niggas try to test me, they ain't know I'm double toted. Gang up your vibe, but today you got the motive. Yeah, I might just pull up deep to the function.